Hi, Explorers! Greetings from my parents' driveway. Winning at life. <laughs> this week, we painted the bathroom in our RV despite a minor setback. So at this point, I'm not sure if I'm gonna die or not. It, it's, I, this RV is a rocking. There's some serious wind outside and water hitting this thing. Plus sign, I don't see any water on my lovely table that I made. Okay, what? Is this closed? This might be broken. Why did this happen? The water's coming through here. And I don't think you're supposed to see <laughs> daylight. I think this plastic thing is worn and old and it should be covering everything. Hopefully it's not too much of an expensive fix. But there's definitely some water coming in. You can see that the joys of RV ownership. We were not gonna let a little bit of water ruin our beautiful new bathroom, although we do have to fix that. Pretty soon. Seriously. <laughs> so we gathered <laughs> our materials and got to work. Working inside an RV can be very cramped and there's a lot of awkward spaces to get into, so we cleared all unnecessary items out of the way. Toilet is gone. Access to this wall here for painting. Also want to remove those hooks and those really weird boxes that nobody should ever have. I think these are cool there. Thank you. After we had a clear route to the walls, the first thing we did was we inspected our walls. We checked if any cracks any holes and we got out our speckle and we put in those holes and then when it was filled in we sanded it nice and down flat with a sander. Inspector Chris. <laughs> The great thing about using this, this pink tap stackle is that when it's done, it dries white, so you know it's ready to sand, which is awesome. We then moved on to Prana. We love our Zinza. Zinza, one, two, three. We always use it, don't we? They should sponsor this video. Yeah, they if you're watching, just support us it, because yeah. we should invest at least in stock <laughs> with them or something. No, but, but seriously, we use it for everything. And the reason we use it is because it really, even though the walls right now in the bathroom are white and they're ready for painting pretty much, we always use it to make sure that it's a nice smooth wall and then it gives us our uh, paint something to stick better to so it has a nice finish. And then you gotta have less time worrying about painting and painting and painting. Man, that rain is loud, isn't it? To the ceiling, so I'm gonna cut to the ceiling, bring it down. Something else that we don't have time for, and other people should definitely not have time for, is blue <laughs> blue painter's tape, honestly. I never use it. I don't, it's con. I, don't, I don't see the point of it, unless <laughs> it's a rip-off. Waste, waste of money. Just get yourself a nice angled brush instead, and just teach yourself to cut in. Chris is like a pro, he's a ninja at cutting in. It's pretty epic. <laughs> so we went with black paint, and it's a very small space, so I can already hear people saying, oh, it's gonna look like a cave. It's not them. gonna look I like was, a cave. I'm one of them. Let me tell yeah. you why. Black is a cool color, which is fine in small spaces. It actually makes them appear larger. Now, if the black paint had any undertones that happened to be warm whatsoever, this would not work. So we got the blackest of black, and it looks beautiful. I'm painting now! I'm painting now! Think he's having fun in the RV? Yes. While we're swimming? I think he's, I think he's gonna be like, I'm just doing all me.
if you ever do have any lines, I mean, we don't in the bathroom, but if you have any little lines or gaps that you want to fill in, I normally get some um, cock that you can paint over and just fill in those lines and then you're golden. Then you paint it again. Right, but you can, before you do the paint, if you have any cracks in it, right, golden, golden, golden enough. Well, we hope that <laughs> this is helpful to you. If you have any questions, please let us know in the comments below. If you have any questions on travel, if you have any questions on painting your RV, or in general renovations, we would love to help you. Thank you so much for watching, and please stick with us, because next Sunday we're going to show you the whole entire bathroom, and let me tell you, it is going to be beautiful. See you next week. Cheers. We always vlog very late at night when the kids are sleeping, so Morgan's pro tip, Use FaceTime as a baby monitor. Look how cute they are. <laughs> this reminds me of like an episode of Are You Afraid of the Dark? Why? I don't know. It always starts Can you hold this for so, a second? It always starts off so innocent and then, you know, something evil happens. I'm gonna tell you my favorite, my favorite ghost story right now. Okay. Okay. Once upon a time, there was, I guess ghost stories probably don't start with once upon a time. But there was a family, they were staying in a tent when they were camping and they went to sleep one night and all of a sudden they woke up and there was a picture of all of them sleeping in the middle of their tent. Wow. <laughs> the last man on earth. He has a knock at the door. That's it.